Pentatonix, thank you. There you go. Pentatonics. Yeah, Pentatonix. Uh, yeah, I like them as a band. They're a really good band. Uh, I like them because I, I knew them before. Up now, but, uh, oh, they are? Well, one guy left, and I don't know The white guy. Now. Wait. <laughs> That's <laughs> all of them except one. <laughs> right. Shut up! Welcome to The Real and Real Pop. My name is David, and I'm here with my co-host, the ever flat-ironed hair... <laughs> Eve! Here on The Real and Real, we take a concept or character from a movie and ask the question, what if it or they were in the real world? We take five minutes to come with three points each and then we discuss, Eve, tell us what the question is today. So the question is, what if everyone was in a band? Anyway, this is in honor of the movie Sing Street, which came out, like, last year, and I think it's on Netflix now, um... I like the movie, but you know, I know I don't think you've seen it, have you? Mm-mm. It was it was fine. It was okay, um, enjoyable enough. And here's my question to you: Do you have any favorite bands? Bands? Yeah, bands, groups, bands. Um, honestly, no. And oh. it's interesting that you said that because I've been wanting to extend my repertoire of music, oh, bands? <laughs> <laughs> of music, oh. including bands. those of bands. Ah. You know, yes. And because honestly, the only band that I know of is. Whoever, <laughs> I was about to say whoever Bruno Mars's band is. He's not. That's not a band. It's Bruno Mars. No, nah, have you taken him away? No, no. That's just Bruno Mars, and he has a band with him. That's uh-huh. every act that goes on stage. Uh-huh. I kind of thought that same. was like his people. That's not a band, though. He doesn't mm-hmm. have a band. Mm-hmm. Then yeah, no, I ain't got nothing. Okay, my favorite band is probably Paramore. Mm-hmm. Um, oh yeah, that's a band. Yeah. Wait, what about? Then my favorite band would be what are those um, the people that sing? Good job, like them. Mm. <laughs> oh, you mean that like the like acapella people? Yeah, the acapella ones. Um, you know what I'm talking about? Yeah, I do. Yeah. Um, goodness, what are their names? Hold on, let me get it. The acapellas. <laughs> the acapellas. That's with a P, maybe. Pentatonics. Thank you. There for you go. Pentatonix. Yeah, Pentatonix. Uh, yeah, I like them as a band. They're a really good band. Uh, I like I, them because I, I knew them broken before. Up now, but, uh, oh, they are? Well, one guy left, and I don't know The white guy. Now. Wait. <laughs> That's it's all of them guys. except one. <laughs> right. The blonde guy. No. Not the leader? No, it's the guy with the dark hair who has the beard. I mean, the dark beard hair guy. He's the, the backup? Yeah, oh. The guy. Yeah, he's oh, man. Yeah, he left. Um, I think he's a group the blonde guy. No. <laughs> He said he was tired of traveling and stuff like that. Um, I used to like Maroon 5 before it became just Adam Levine. Oh, yeah. Um, I like, even though for some reason this is a running joke that people don't like them. I like Nickelback. I don't understand why people don't like them. Why? People don't like them for some reason. I'm like, somebody's buying the albums, okay? Right. I'm not buying, yeah, like them somebody's putting them on the charts. So I don't understand why this universal like it, joke. Like, let hate. me listen to what I hate. <laughs> yeah, I guess this so. verse sucks. This verse sucks. You do realize but all plays. of them. <laughs> but all of them. Uh, what are the rock bands out there? I like some Corn. I like some um, Flyleaf. I like some um, Paris. I like some. Um, what other bands do I have? We're talking about just all bands? Boys and men, does they count as a band? Is that a band? It's a group of guys. It's a band of men. But they don't play? I thought, do you have to play an instrument? Well, Pentatonix has no instrument, so what now? What's the their excuse? instrument is their voice. <laughs> so then it's boys and men. <laughs> I'm going to go with instruments. It's like saying 98 the degrees is a band. It's the same thing. <laughs> it is, but it's just that. I'm just like, yeah, I didn't think of it by yourself. You didn't do that. No, you didn't. <laughs> Like, when we're thinking about just instruments, then I just name most of the ones with instruments. Um, I'm probably forgetting some people that I really like. Um, that's like saying in sync. Well, I guess in sync was a boy band. band. It's a boy band. But you mean just rock bands? We're talking about rock bands. Okay. So I guess you have boys to men. No, they're not rock bands. So I mean, they're a band. They're a band. They're not rock. So they're. A- the, uh, I don't think they should get the band of the title of band. They that's they just not. That's just not feeling that boys to men. Nah. Nah. <laughs> Love Boys and the Men. Y'all did great, but <laughs> Temptations. <a> what? <laughs> what? What? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? So they can't. Uh, so so basically, Temptations came first. The Boys and the Men are like the new age one of them. And now they're past and then Pentatonix says, they're in the middle. The, they can't count as a band, but the ones before them, the ones after them can. Well, yeah. Cause the that, Gap Band. That's a band. <laughs> that was just, that. I, don't, I just, I'm not, I can't think band and think Boys to Men. 
That is so dumb and funny. Um, anyway, let's get to this. It is. Cause it, uh, man, I feel like I should know more. I have more. Oh, gorillas. I love gorillas. Um, I feel like I've heard gorillas before. You have. Uh, uh, I'm missing like a bunch, guys. I'm sorry. I do listen to a lot of music. so it's, it's, Me too, but I don't it's know It's flowing in and fly, flowing out. Like I have over like a, like 4,000 songs. Fall Fallout songs. Boy. That is not... <laughs> They count, technically. I like them. Yeah. My Chemical Romance. I love that. There you go. But anyway, uh, let's get to this. <laughs> what if everybody was in a uh-huh. band? Three points in five minutes. Three, two, one. Go. And, and we're, we're back. Okay, I'm done. Great. Before we get to the show, just to let y'all know, I don't know what you listen to us on, but you can also find us on our hosting site, Podbean, which you can also donate to and become a patron and get some cool stuff. Also, we are on YouTube, iTunes, TuneIn, Google Play, Stitcher, Sound. SoundCloud, uh, Instagram. Oh, and we're also on WordPress. Okay. You create a site? Here's the thing. When I got Podbean, it was, it was how, you know, where you can attach your links uh-huh. And it was like, oh, you can attach to Tumblr. I was like, okay, I got that. You can attach to YouTube. Okay, I got that. You can attach to Twitter. Okay, I got that. And it was like, you can attach to WordPress. I was like, I don't know what that is. And so I went to WordPress. I was like, whatever, I'll create an account. But then when I created I was like, I don't think I did it right. I didn't start it anything or whatever. I was like, forget it. I'm oh not going to pay attention to this. But apparently I li- kept it c- Link. linked. Because uh-huh. when I posted this recent episode, it was like, something, something like your post on WordPress. I was like, wait, it went on there. <laughs> I, thought, I thought I had to pay something. I didn't know. To, yeah, to work. I was like, no, they I have didn't a know. free one and a Yeah, but I thought the free one didn't work because it was like you have to get premium or something like that. So I was like, forget this. I'm not going to set this up. So today right. I set it up. It actually looks like it's ours. So yeah, we're on WordPress too. I can't. <laughs> but back to the show. Uh, the question was what if everyone was in a band? Yes. Ladies first. My first point is awesome. After that, not so much. But I mean, you could have. <laughs> Just say my first point is awesome, period. And then we'll be disappointed later, but now we know the disappointment's coming. Exactly. I like to prepare people. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so <laughs> first point is more money will be given to the arts program. Love it. Yes. Love it. And that's it. Being I, that both of us appreciate the arts and... Or were a part of them. And as in were a part of them. And technically still part of the entertainment version of it, I guess. We're still part of the arts. Yeah, we love the arts. Arts are great. I love the arts. Teach kids to paint, draw, okay. sing, play an instrument. What are the dance? Dance, act, act. <laughs> I love how paints and writing. Writing, yes, mm-hmm. I should have said that. Yes, I that was. Are you writer. a writer? Yeah, I'm a writer. Yeah. I've not written in yeah. a while though. But mm-hmm. hey, man, I can collab with somebody. Right. Let's go. Um, yes. I feel yeah. that if kids were more, if we had more arts, mm-hmm. we had more intelligence. I'd say less violence. All of your stuff is being released through the art. And you're not, like, focused on video games and shooting people in, in sports and hitting people and stuff like that. Well, not that see, all sports now, involve video hitting. Video games is considered an art. That's not. No. It, just because no, it's, it's called uh, electronic arts does not mean it's... <laughs> visual. Someone had to draw that. Someone True, had to write it the out. The art portion is art. But not... Because <laughs> technically, not the a swastika like the could be considered art. But not hey, the actual meaning behind art it. Art is subjective. What? Hey. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, yeah, so the art, the painting and everything, I'm, I'm really feeling that. I think they're taking away arts and putting it, because art doesn't make money in school. It doesn't. The they don't think does. it has an actual career. It takes, but, it takes money away from the sports, yes. Okay, I think it's this. People can see sports mm-hmm. with a more direct path. Art is so subjective. winding. No, not subjective. I'm saying just winding in a path. Because mm-hmm. every time you ask a actor, how do you make or whatever, they say... Every every time you read a book or something like, how do I make it in the industry? How da 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 how da 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 da. It's never the same answer because right. everyone has their own path. People can't see a straight path, so they're just like, oh, forget the arts. All our money is coming from sports, f- specifically football over everything, and then basketball, football, basketball, and then all other sports we really don't care about. But they some soccer starting to become really because soccer's awesome but um yeah it's mostly going to football and stuff like that Mm -hmm. and i think that's why they push it they're getting rid of the you know arts because they can't see they're like oh this just for foo-foo people i would say yeah that's just it's horrible because i think arts would it would i think it would decrease the violence because you have somewhere else to release out to put your emotion as an outlet yes come on people Mm -hmm. you know what and then you could play a football player (laughs) 
You oh can God. play a basketball player no. in a movie. You don't have to be that because getting in the NFL is very slim. Being an actor, it's slim, but here's the you thing. You can do, you could be an actor for the entirety of your life. No, but here, no, I wasn't going to say that. No, I was going to I was going to say this because like, both no of them, no, no, I mean, not cap. even that. Well, technically, if you're in sports, if you can kick a ball, there's no age gap because you can become a punter. But anyway, here's the thing. With sports, mm-hmm. sports is, I mean, especially football. NFL, that's it. Like, that's the cap. There's, like, and there's, only, there's thousands and thousands of people that go out for football. Mm-hmm. And thousands and thousands of people don't get drafted each year, okay? Right. And then that's it. They go off now and do regular jobs. Now you're talking about the ones that got jobs. injured in college. No, I'm okay. not talking about all of them. Okay, just Concussion. regular people. Just, you're, you're a great person. You're awesome. You never got injured, whatever. You just didn't make it because you weren't up to speed or whatever. Whatever reasons, okay? But here's the thing. Acting. It also is hard because there's thousands and thousands of people. Mm-hmm. But here's the thing. There's more productions being in place than there are, like, football seasons, okay? Football so you games. Can, yeah, football games. You Well, to get on a team. So season in order oh, to get yeah. drafted. Mm-hmm. So you can find something somewhere. Where you might not be on – see, people think, oh, I didn't make it because I'm not a movie. You could be on a TV show. You can be on Broadway. You can be on a commercial. You can be on, like – You can play the step-in for somebody. You can play the st- – I mean, stand-in for somebody. You can be the back person. You hand can be, model, like, hand mo- model. There are so many things Hair that model. are available to you, and it's more options than playing sports. So I'm just saying, all right, you can do it. And then in music, you have more options because you have no one telling you no. You can go, and there's no cap. Football, you don't make it. You ain't making it. It ain't like you're like, it. I can convince you to give me a... <laughs> no, like, that's it. You, Your yeah, talent again. can only go so far. Whereas music, you can teach yourself multiple instruments. You can't have somebody telling you no. Now, you might not be able to sing, but you know what? You can play that instrument all you want to. And there you can you write, you can compose. You can write, compose. Come and on, again, you can learn all these ageless. things. You can be 85 and be an actor. Yes, exactly. Look at... What's his face? I was gonna say our teacher, but he was. Oh, he's in. Um, he was in Center. Matter of fact. Oh, was he? Wait, who are you talking about? I was talking about Michael Cole. That's who I was talking about. Oh, okay. Yeah, okay. Michael Cole. Uh, if you don't, if you haven't seen Center, it's on USA. He is the um, not the corner. Mm-hmm. Uh, the when when the when she originally when you see in the trailer where she the trailer. If you see in the promo where she stabs the guy, mm-hmm. the cop that comes up and tell explains what who that is. That was one of our teachers. His name is Michael Cole. He's really okay. awesome. He's solid in everything he's in. You've probably seen him in like uh, the Mary last Jane. movies I remember. Me, Mary, Mary Jane. Jane. Uh, movies. He was in Argo. Uh, mm-hmm. He was at the desk table with everybody else. He was in Vacation, which was a good movie. But whatever, he's good in it. He's fine. But uh, he didn't have any talking lines in that one, though. I don't think. But in Argo, he did. But mm-hmm. his lines were off screen when he spoke. But anyway, mm-hmm. the point is, he's great. He's solid. Love seeing him. But um, what were we talking about? Um, Your point? Uh, no, but what what was the wrap up? Uh, oh, I was just saying that you could be ageless because yeah, you, I think you were gonna think. Oh, I was old. gonna say um. This guy that's in, um, he was in Steven Spielberg's last movie with Tom Hanks, and he was the, it was uh, Spies on a Bridge, Bridge, Bridge of Spies, Spies on a Bridge, Bridge of Spies, he's in that, and then he ended up in the BFG, which I still didn't see and nobody went to see, apparently. Mm-hmm. But, uh, yeah, he's an older actor. Uh, look at Morgan Freeman, still going. Uh, I don't know if he was ever in Washington, um, Will Smith, he's not for whatever reason. He's not old either. Um, they don't count. I'm talking about old, old. old like old. Helen Mirren. Like... Uh, <laughs> Oh, what's the name? Bet not Betty White. Betty White, yeah, Betty, <laughs> Is it White. Betty White. Yeah, Betty yeah, White. Okay. She's still going strong. Mm-hmm. Go ahead, Betty White. Right. We love you. But anyway, my point. <laughs> what is it? Drug dealers will go out of business. Wow. I oh, <laughs> when I say I've never disagreed with a point so hard, but by all means. Now tell me why you disagree. I'm gonna tell you why you, you can't disagree. I disagree because mm-hmm. many true. No, I won't say that. Many creatives that I personally know mm-hmm. that use things to get them stimulant to play or get hired or write or something, right? Not that they. It helps them get free. If they up. they they perf- they like to do it, mm-hmm. so it gets them out of a lot of people. I feel their in the creative mind, industry have mental issues that they don't know how to deal with. They can't block it out exactly. So getting away from reality. Not everybody. Right. Everybody's not, not like this. To some people, right. So it's a stigma in the rock nation that to be able, you have some that are like, "Hey, let me get this buzz on. That way, yeah. I can do this graphic gotcha, design." Gotcha. And then you have some that are like, "I just need to completely escape but reality." Here's the thing. I think all that will happen. That's why I think drugs are good out of this. Because I think we'll run out. Oh my God. <laughs> 
So technically, you agree with me because I, I was like, oh, more people do drugs. I'm like, if more people do drugs, everybody's in a band. We run out of drugs, man. That that crop will be gone. That weed will be gone. Crack, whatever gonna, used to make crack, will be with gone. The new, they just come with a new. They're gonna keep drug. trying, but I'm just saying the ones we know now gone and then drug deals will be gone because people be like oh I just gotta get it from the source because now they're like companies we gotta ship this stuff out in bulk like we are running out fast gone so I'm just saying like that we wouldn't have anymore just everyone's all up on drugs then all of a sudden everyone's sober because we ain't <laughs> listen we been talking nothing about the um what is that the withdrawals oh they they go crazy yes uh, but you know what we might get some good withdrawal music out of that what What's your next point? My next point. Did mm-hmm. you say yours? Yeah, you did. Okay. Yeah, I just did. What do you mean? <laughs> Drugs. Gone. Gone. <laughs> rah, rah. Fresh out, son. My next point is that the arts will become a main subject in school instead of an extracurricular. So just like math you have to take, you would have then, to What's your first point about arts, though? The arts program would get more money. So now it's just going to be a main subject? It would be a main subject. So I mean, I thought class, that would be the case if it became if it got more money. You mean, oh, like, it's, you mean like it's mandatory? Yeah, it's mandatory. Like I feel like if something's getting more money, it's a mandatory thing. I don't know. I was just thinking. It's just like football. Football's not mandatory, but it gets more money. But football's not a class. No, but they have class. No, they don't. I mean, you practicing. Is that not your class? No, it's no? not. What is that not? What is that? That's like track after school. It's not a part of your class. Football's not a, not a part of your classes. It's not like PE where you can go to football. No, it's after class. Mm. I mean, it's after school. Yeah, okay. <laughs> well, these man, you know how much. Well, the arts. Right. Even if you got the arts, would still be after. It would be an extracurricular, even if they had more. Well, I just said it was a mandatory now. It's mandatory. My second point. You were talking about my first point. Oh, uh, more yeah. money. Okay. Yeah. So okay. So, this would be like just like this we is have a point. Math. Now you have to take a class, right? Like you so have I have to, to pick take... between some. I guess music, writing, or. Music, acting writing, or... drama. Um, but see, now this is Why what is it I called thinking. drama? Why is it not just called acting? I don't know. It's called Shakespeare. Does comedians count as... Uh, drama? Yeah, acting. Is that acting? Um, what is the word? Um, when you go off script, uh, that's what they would be considered. That's still acting. Um, um, but that's not a comedian. I mean, that's you're a comedian, but not stand-up, technically. But isn't you a comedian? No, but you're improv. Um, uh, improv. Uh, oh, I wanted to guess do. it. <laughs> I was like, I was just thinking about Keegan Michael Key, and I was like, oh man, but uh, yeah, improv. But no, this would be what I was saying is that you have a school set up. So what do we have? We have English, math, science, and history. Those are like the main four, right? Isn't that something I'm missing? English, math, science, science and history. history. No, I think that's it. That's about it. That's so with I those, of. I was thinking English would just go ahead and take out. English will be no. You need English. No, no. I'm have saying you heard these people talk to. <laughs> <No. laughs> I was saying you have English, but English would be just writing. Like English would be writing class. You would still learn how to write. No, (laughs) English has to do with English, and that's also I think sometimes mixed with speech. People need all that because you you need your speech class separate from. Because here's the thing: everyone's not going to take drama and acting. Right? They still need to learn how to talk (laughs) and give speeches. They gotta have that class. But that's why you should mix instead of adding these extra. No, you know what should be taken out? What science. (laughs) Math, you can do general math, but technically you can take the complicated math out. Those are for people who are majoring right, in that stuff. Okay, we don't, we don't need any of that. No, no. Science, I don't. We don't need any I have not algebra. used anything from science. <laughs> anything. You, you could have simply said, "This is hot. This is cold. That's all I need to know." Okay, don't <laughs> touch this. Touch this. This will get you sick. This will get you. This will burn you. Like that's all I need. Everything else, you all these chemicals and stuff that I, I ain't looked at the periodic table in how long. <laughs> <laughs> I, didn't even, I didn't even know what aluminum Man. is on the periodic table. Mm. Nothing is plus. But yeah, I need to know two plus. I need to know the simple stuff of math. Mm-hmm. But science, there is nothing that I, unless you what's the different. There are different kinds of sciences. Like you got earth Biology, science, or whatever. Earth science. Earth, I get. I get chemistry. the basics of knowing the earth and the crust and the moon and the planets and all that. Other okay. Stuff. Or how about this? Science will become an extracurricular. That's something that you Not the shoot. basics, though. I need to, you know. Yeah, not the basics. people that think the world is flat. Actually, the world ain't flat. Okay, y'all need to know the world is round. I don't know. That's a, that's that's skeptical, depending on what, what facts you find out. There are no, the facts are done. Fact, I don't know. No, no. I don't, know. don't be those people. Don't it's, be those it's people. It's the reason why all nations have come together and banned visitation to certain parts of our Antarctica. Because I mean, you're doing illegal things anyway. Exactly. What's the end? What's over? Well, actually, there is a thing that's being, like, there are certain things in the article that we hold there. Like, for instance, there's a, um, if I'm not mistaken, a seed plant that we hold there. Where, Just one? No, no. It's a huge... <laughs> 
a bunch of seeds and stuff, and mm-hmm. when they go extinct, if they go extinct, we can extract them and put them back into our ecosystem. Sounds like BS. But it's a deep uh, underground and stuff up in Antarctica. Mm. It's real. But anyway, um, what are you about? oh, I was saying, so you can make science. Chemical, chemical science, chemistry, biology, those sciences. Those, are for the terrorists. <laughs> those sciences would be extracurricular. Because you can still use chemistry and drama. If you want to create the ice, the dry ice and that, did you, you know explosions. What you do? No, you know what you do? You go get a chemistry kit, you bring them over, say, we need it because you're working on the set. You go, you go help us with the set. Like, for instance, I'm in drama, right? Mm hmm. We need someone to paint this set. We go to get the people from art, and they come over. We, we go to a place where they do like improv. They have that in Atlanta. That would be fun. The only thing I'm not gonna like is if they do that thing where they call you out. What do you mean? It's like I'm looking for my. There he is in the in the audience right there, and I'm like, no, 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 no. I don't want to be a part of this. Don't pull me up there. Don't pull me up there. Oh yeah, something like that. That's what I want. Don't do that to me. Like it's good. But I do want to go. That'd be fun. I think that would be fun. That would be funny. Anyway, uh, on to my Oh, because my, yeah, my point is that drama, music, writing, acting, Mandatory. Class. You got to pick one. Yeah, that's what I wanted to ask you. Which one would you pick? Oh, easy. Drama. Easy drama choice. and writing. Oh, you're picking... Oh, I thought one was mandatory. So the other one's just extra curriculum. Oh, you can take the algebra and calculus out. I'm done with <laughs> <You> that. <can. laughs> and the science. I'm not going I'm not going to make none out of If you can only pick one, oh, which one are you picking? Drama. Okay. Yeah. I am probably picking... Writing. I want to say music because I do love singing, but my stage fright would make me pick writing. <laughs> what about what do you mean your stage fright? You don't have to be on in front of the stage. What would I, what would I be? You would be behind the person actually singing. I don't want to be a person. <laughs> <laughs> Like if I'm not in the front, I'm not in it all. all. (laughs) Writing, yes, I'm behind the actors, but I'm the head writer. Like I'm, I am here. My name comes up there, not like when you sing and it's like the person is like back down at the bottom, background singers. No, I am the writer in the front. Yes, yes, yes. yes. It's funny because I have stage fright as well. But if I'm able to play someone that's not me, I can do a lot. None of them are you. This maybe <laughs> <laughs> someone got too real. This what? part is too real. It's too much. Too my life. I can't what? play this on stage. Too close to home. Too close to home. I can't. Oh, <laughs> ah, that is so funny. I'm just hitting the mic like <laughs> this, like crazily. But um, your point. Okay. Um, there would be a lot more tattoo artists. In matter of fact, there'd be tattoo artists to go with the bands when they travel. Ben, tattoos. Yeah, band tattoo artists. Yeah, band tattoo artists. All ta- all all band people are getting tattoos. You got to get tattoos of memorable moments, or as a band, you got to get a, a, a like a something that with your band name or something. I'm sure all band members have tattoos somewhere. It's like a staple in the band community. Everybody has a tattoo. Why not just uh, can we say body artists maybe? Because what about like don't fancy them up? They're tattoo <laughs> no, artists. No, because I'm thinking of like henna tattoos. No, this is we need face pain. No, we need <laughs> what? No body pain. No, no, no. You're getting legit tattoos. Okay. Um, Do you have a tattoo? Yeah. What is it? It's back here. That's where, <laughs> not what. Oh, it's a flower going into the. I about to say the in Virgo sign, the Virgo sign. Oh, okay, I thought you said in my butt crack. That's what I thought it was going to be. <laughs> You said in, Some I was like, people. my butt crack. Okay. <laughs> but anyway, well, what's your next uh, point? My last point. Yeah, that last point. Tell us the last point. Is that there would be more people dying from overdose. You stealing my drugs thing? Yep. <laughs> you can't die from overdose with no more drugs in the world? But see, because there's so many drugs, so many more people died from overdose. Thief. Thieves? You're a thief. No, no, no. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> No, no, no. That would be my argument time to in rob court. Somebody. <laughs> rob somebody. Are you still in that? No, no, no. No, no, no. as you're backing up. No, no, no. No, no. no. <laughs> no, no. You're leaving right now. No, no, no. No, no. no. no, no. no. Baby, did you cheat on me? No, no, no. <laughs> no. You're in our bed with other men. No, no, no. No, no. Slowly getting out. Yeah, like, yeah just like, no, no. No, 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 no. No, no. 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 Like, no. he's still right there. No, 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 no. It's like, you're not a Jedi. You're not making me forget this. No. But, yeah, thief. Anyway, um, I guess that makes sense. Yeah. Whatever. <laughs> okay, my last point is that everyone would go deaf. Because everybody's playing? You're playing rock music. It's very loud. Okay. Why is everybody a rock band or playing rock music? You're no classical? Bands. 
Nah, we're doing hardcore bands, okay? Uh-huh. Even classical. You got your speakers up. You got to out drown the other people next door. Okay. Turn that thing up with your little fancy violin. Boom, 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 boom. Loud. Right. right. Some people can't get down. Get your, uh, what's that man's name? Yo, yo, my on. Oh. It's cello playing. Mm. Yep. There you go. Okay. Only found out about him really after watching an episode of Arthur. <laughs> Did you really? Yeah, because uh, grandma took um, DW to go see to a concert. Oh. She was like, I don't want to go here. And then all of a sudden she went like, wow, he's amazing. And then she wanted hey, to start Mr. playing. Hey, Mr. Yo-Yo Ma. No, she didn't want to start playing. She just started playing oh. the music at home. Ain't no way to go get a cello. What? <laughs> <laughs> that family was, that family was poor. They weren't poor, but they. They, they, were, they were middle class. I don't know. I don't know. Arthur got really mad about that uh, helicopter. I mean, that plane he made. Like, he couldn't go get another one. Like, he saved up. <laughs> well, he ain't have no job. kid. I, you better be mad. I ain't about to go buy you another one. That's true. Mm-hmm. Because he did tell her it didn't fly. She mm-hmm. still threw it. She deserved to get punched. I don't care what anyone say. That's the only episode I did not like. Because I think that was bad. Uh, did she get punched? The episode where she he made the plane right. Mm-hmm. Then he's like, she threw it. Mm-hmm. And this man took a long time on this plane. He's, and then he, this it's the meme you see where Arthur's fist is balled up. Mm-hmm. That's what that meme is, guys. When you see, it's a cartoon, even if you don't know it's Arthur. It's a cartoon meme of a fist balled up with it. He's wearing a yellow, like, uh, sweater. Mm-hmm. And his hand's brown. And he has blue pants. That's Arthur, okay? And his fist is balled up because he's mad because DW, his little sister, threw his model plane that he took time it. on, orange plane, threw it, out the pl- threw it out the window, does not fly, and broke it. He's like, I told you it doesn't fly. She would put that thing back together. Hit her. Didn't They didn't show the hit. They show her falling down on her butt and then grabbing her arm and going, and mom and running. Yeah. Then she snitched, okay? <laughs> told mom and dad. Then they, blamed, <laughs> they, they, they got him. He got in trouble. She didn't get anything, okay? Mm-hmm. I was like, I don't believe in this punishment right now. Yes, he was wrong for hitting her. Right, which he would have gotten in trouble she, for. He would have gotten in trouble for. She shouldn't have threw the man's plane right. after when he told which you. she would have picked up every little and, bit of pee. Yeah, it was like, we know you suck as our daughter. You are very rude and very you sucky, okay? Arthur isn't as bad as you because he's a lame, okay? If I was a, <laughs> oh, my goodness. If I was a parent, I'd be... Is this how you speak to your children? <laughs> to, to like, listen, your brother is a little bit more talented than you. No, he's but not. But you are still it was like, No, I was, I was saying You're this. horrible No, this is what I say to those parents. Uh, you know Arthur. He's not talented at anything, okay? His friend is the cool one. Buster, everyone likes him. No one likes Arthur. He's just a tag along, okay? Um. He's the lame. This is not like Hey Arnold and, uh, and uh, Gerald. Both of them are equally cool. Gerald's slightly more cooler because he's the black kid and everybody likes him. Arthur is nothing. He has nothing, okay? He is literally just plain Jane, okay? He, 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 he all he had. Never ask you for the truth. All he had was this bottle plane, okay? Daddy, what did you think of me? <laughs> You're plain. <laughs> You're plain. <laughs> okay, it's and all you, get DW, out. DW, you are annoying. You're an annoying <laughs> little child. No one likes you. The only people worse than you are the Tibble twins, okay? And technically, only one of them is worse than you because the other one's pretty was okay. The, face, the one that bullies he's Arthur. He's okay he because him. he's conflicting, okay? Because sometimes he's a friend, sometimes he's not. So he's okay. And plus, his name is named after a great band called Binky, okay? Awesome. Awesome. Great, great. Go find the song if you haven't. Look up Binky Arthur. It's really, really catchy. I think it's in Swedish or something. I have the song on my phone. Mm-hmm. Uh, I can't understand a word. But it sounds good. Uh, but anyway, um, yeah, let's go to our punch real quick. What you got? Let me tell you. Someone's sleeping. <laughs> okay, so my points are more money for the arts program. Money. Then um, arts. What is what's the subject? Art classes would actually become mandatory? a part of mandatory, and we're gonna take out science and math. Well, algebra and up, um, and more overdoses <laughs> from drugs. My three points is that <laughs> drug dealers will go out of business because so many drug people taking drugs, <laughs> drug shortage gone. Uh, there will be tattoo artists uh, that would travel with the bands. They more tattoo call artists. Them body artists. Nope, tattoo artists, mm-hmm. and everyone would go deaf because all the loud music. Fun fact is that Oculus Rift actually was a body artist. Like he didn't do permit, but he did like for festivals and stuff. He did the Naked Girls and. So fun fact, your man, mm-hmm. which no one else knows. Yes. So in case they meet him, yes. they don't know his real name. Yes. They say, hey, I heard you did body art. And he say, okay, who are you? Yes. <laughs> Weird person. Yes. <laughs> he says, okay. oh, should listen to the podcast. <laughs> but even if he does, no one's going to know who he is. Hey. And even when we get big, unless he shows up at a convention, no one's going to know who he is. Hey. I can't say even if we. When we get big Aww. and we have a giant billboard. I think we'll get big not off the podcast. Aw. 
That's not, I mean. I think we will. We'll be the biggest podcast ever. After we get big because of something else. We no. Did. We'll be the biggest podcast ever. Let your friends know. We are the biggest podcast ever. Because it'll be connected to the podcast. No, we're being the biggest podcast ever, period. All the podcasts get that rip and then we'll get other opportunities. Anyway, that's the show, guys. <laughs> Thanks for listening. Eve, where can they find you? They can find me in the real world. Where we'll get big, not all Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Words have power and you're just knocking us down. You won't get big. I'll get big off the I podcast. Said, okay. It's fine. <laughs> You get big off uh, helping your people, I guess. No, we would both get big, just not because of the podcast. I'm getting big off the. I'm be humongous off the podcast. To, it'll be connected. The podcast, to the podcast is going to blow up. It is, but not no. Because <laughs> <laughs> anyways, you can find me at Miss Lovely underscore. Go ahead and stay Cash! with me. You can find me at It's a Christian. Thanks for listening, guys. Uh, what, what, what's the last thing I said last time? Like, subscribe, and share. Great. Bye. <laughs> Oh my.